to heat indices in the triple digits and thousands of people having to live through this with no power. Thanks for joining us. I'm Sion Rhodes and I'm Jonathan Martinez. Right now, most of that power has been restored, but at the peak of the afternoon heat, Texas, New Mexico power reported nearly 9000 customers without service. This is a look at the areas impacted Texas City, Dickinson and even parts of Leak City. Channel 2's Robert Arnold live with more on how this all got started. Robert. Yeah, with the humidity today, temperatures felt like they were over 100 degrees. Terrible time to be without power. Now, as you had mentioned, Texas, New Mexico power reported at the peak 8,900 people were without electricity. The reason, according to Texas, New Mexico power, a bird hit a line at a substation. So crews have been out trying to get power restored. Galveston County Emergency Management even opened a cooling center at Hughes Road Elementary School in Dickinson. Some people, though, were lucky enough to be able to head to a relative's house to keep cool. I was on my way home from church and he called and said, Mom, the lights are out. So I said, contact New Mexico and ask the neighbors next door and see if their power is out too. And sure enough, it was. And this is like the third time it's happened. So I was just like, well, OK, well, let's load them up and go to mom so we can get some AC. This power outage affected not just homes, but also businesses up and down 45. The good news, though, according to Texas New Mexico Power, all but 36 people have had power restored. Reporting live from Galveston County, Robert Arnold, KBRC Channel 2 News. Robert, thank you.